hello everyone welcome back to our youtube channel today we have an exciting topic to help you improve your english thinking skills if you want to become more fluent and confident in english then these seven smart ways will be your guide in today's video i am going to teach you that how to think in english in a perfect way so i'll tell you seven smart ways to think in english that will be literally fantastic for your improvement in english whether you want to be fluent or whether you want to be more confident okay so tip number one is to surround yourself with english first of all you have to be surrounded then you will start thinking in english if you will not be surrounded by english so you will never start thinking in english so the first step is that you have to be surrounded by english immerse yourself in the language by watching movies tv shows or listening to podcasts in english okay this exposure will bring you think in english more naturally so when you will be surrounded then definitely automatically after some time your mind will start thinking itself in english because 24 by 7 you will be surrounded by that okay next whether it's book article or online content reading helps you encounter new words and phrases so you must read okay we have to read regularly if we will not then definitely we are not gonna improve okay so this will really encounter new words and phrases that expand your thinking ability in english so once you will start reading books and articles so you will be you'll be seeing various things in that and you are going to learn them or you're going to learn from that you're going to learn some from that okay set language goals there must be goals okay establish achievable go uh, language goals such as reading a book in english or watching a movie without subtitles so there should be goals okay this motivates you to think more in english to achieve those milestones so there must be goals if you will not set language goals so you are literally not gonna improve that much that much you should okay so you should set, set such goals that i am going to watch a movie without subtitles maybe i'll understand it or i'll be, read a book in english okay or i'll read a novel next practice speaking aloud you must practice speaking aloud you must use your senses if you the more senses you use for learning it the better you will learn that language okay talk to yourself in english or find language partners to engage in conversation okay verbalization your thoughts in english will strengthen your uh, cognitive connection to the language so first of all practice speaking aloud so you can do discussions with your friends you can do discussions with your classmates or you have to find someone to discuss with so like this you will be speaking aloud think in english next you must try to think in english as well as like uh, sit aside for some time for 10 to 20 minutes and try to visualize try to think in english okay whenever you face a situation or problem try to think about it in english first okay like if something happens to you or something happens good or bad to you so you have to think in english about that this practice will help you form thoughts directly in english by passing translation okay so if you will follow this rule as well eh? so you are gonna improve in thinking you will definitely improve in thinking okay next engage with online language apps so you must be surrounded as i said before so like this online language apps you must be engaged with okay utilize language learning apps that encourage daily practice and gamify the learning process make it enjoyable to think in english okay you can find apps also for learning the english for understanding the english in a better way so this will definitely help you if you will do such things if you will literally practice and gamify the learning process then this will literally become enjoyable for you to think in english next expand your vocabulary vocabulary is literally very important in any language so expand your vocabulary learn synonyms antonyms and idioms a broader vocabulary provides more options for your thoughts typically in english so if you will do this thing if you will start uh, expanding your vocabulary so definitely after some time it will be easier for you to understand the words it will be easier for you to know the english of the difficult words because you will know the difficult words after some time when you start reading the words when you start learning the words when you start expanding your vocabulary remember practice is the key to success okay so implement these steps into your daily routine if you found this video helpful give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more language learning content if you have any questions you can write them in the comment sections 
I'll try to answer them definitely. Thank you so much. See you next time. Allah Hafiz.